Let me show you how to measure a gap without using a caliper. I'm referring here to a wooden box that was made by Matthias Bandel with the intention of a very snug fit. Details and video on woodgears.ca. The box is in fact a mortise and a hollowed tenon for a top. The gap between obviously is small, but how small exactly? Let's acquire some information from the video Panther Outer Box. The top sinks in within two seconds. That takes so long because the air inside has to come out through the gap. Assuming a laminar flow, we can try to use this equation. It's about how fast the air comes through a gap and that depends on how big that is. So in reverse, the gap can be calculated if we know everything else in this equation. Let's try. We know the time. H is the width of the cross section and we have to use the total circumference of the tenon for that. The volume that has to come out is 4 times 7 times 5 which makes 140 cu cubic centimeters. L is the length of the gap in the direction of the flow of air. That varies from 0 to 4 centimeters, so let's use 2 centimeters as an average. A bit more difficult is the calculation of the pressure. It's force per area. The force is the gravitational force. We need the density of wood and the volume of the top. Again guessed from the video. So the pressure might be 274 Pascal. Eta is the viscosity. Let's fill all this in and calculate the third root. It turns out that the gap has 0.16 mm or because of the amount of guesswork roughly 0.2 millimeters. Sounds realistic. 